Alrighty, we are out here at the range. Target's at 100 yards. It's a nice day. It's probably 75, 76 degrees out. Slight breeze off the left, but it's really a nice day. Um, this is my 25 inch 6.5x47 Lapua and my uh, Seekins Havoc hit um, that I chambered. 1 and 8 twist and we're shooting a 135A tip from Hornady. Um, we're using the load you see up on the screen there and uh, we're just going to go ahead and see how they shoot. The gun is cold, but the gun is not clean, so uh, we may see a cold bore. We didn't the last time we shot the burger, so I'm curious if we'll see a cold bore with the ATIP here. Um, kind of making up low data again because we are shooting the, uh, the Varget, and there's not a whole lot of really good data. Lab radar is out, and we'll just go ahead and we'll see how they group. 35.5 grains here. Should be about 2,700 feet per second on this first load. 2661, so a little slower than what I thought. Um, this load shot 26, or sorry, 2715 with uh, 130. So I guess the five grain heavier projectile. Dropped our velocity just a little bit. That's fine. Messed up our aim point there a little bit, which made it a little bit harder to keep a consistent aim point, but looks like we still shot a nice group. Just take a quick look at our brass. Um, the brass actually looks fine. We'll see what our velocity was there. Alright, so those five shots we averaged 26.65 with an extreme spread of 7.5 and, and an SD of 3.4. So good looking data there. And we'll go up to 36.5 grains, which is obviously a grain higher than what we just shot. The barrel is obviously warmed up now, and we'll see how these shoot. Hopefully they shoot like that first load with a little bit more velocity. Messed the group up there with that last shot, didn't we? Felt like a pretty good shot. Still a good looking group. Brass still looks fine. Take a look at velocity. Alright, so those five we had 2720 average with a 14 extreme spread and a 5.4 SD. So still good numbers. The group still looks pretty good. Um, we did kind of lose that one out to the left. Uh, probably didn't change our overall group size though because we did string just a little bit vertical. So obviously you see a group sizes and the velocity on the screen there. So looks like the A-tips are going to do pretty good and we did get up over 2700 feet per second with these charges. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I should be out at Rainers here soon. Don't know if I'm going to make a video of it or not, but we'll see you after that. Thanks for watching.